This is the Black Ops 6 Zombies 2 box challenge. The rules are that I have to hit the box twice and those two guns are what I get for the whole entire match. I can't upgrade the rarity or switch the attachments, I'm stuck with what I get. The goal is to get to round 31 and exfil on Terminus and Liberty Falls, let's go. Alright, two box challenge on Terminus, so the way this is gonna work is- why am I in third person? <laughs> The way this is going to work is until I hit the box, I'm just going to use the knife. So that way I'm not like cheating. Well, I might die actually. It's, it's round one. I'm going to die, dude. So the two box count. Get away from me. This was suggested to me by a viewer. And he made actually a really good point because he said you only have two hits. What if instead of upgrading your gun, you just only have the two hits and you're stuck with the color you get? What? Why did everybody just disappear? So we're going to go ahead. We're going to spin for our first gun right now. And then we're going to wait to pull off the second hit until later. So I can get a better color gun because we're going to get. Okay. I got it. Are you serious? Out of everything I could have gotten, <laughs> I got the pistol. Are you serious? All right. This is going to be a little bit rough. So if you remember last video, I had this really loud keyboard that I bought that I didn't know was going to be so loud. So I'm attempting to make it a little bit quieter by um, putting it all the way across my desk and I'm stretching my arm out like a freak right now. I really, I really should have got a webcam for this video to have like a keyboard cam. My arm, oh my god, don't break it. No, stop it. <laughs> this stupid ass pistol is not strong enough to protect this thing. Okay, we got it, we got it, we got it good. Yeah, we're going to be buying a lot of ammo for this pistol. See, I would be okay if I got the GS45 because the GS45 is the one that when you upgrade it, it turns into like like a Mustang and Sally. That's good. That That's great. That's awesome. This thing, I have no idea what happens when you pack this. But with my luck, I'm going to guess absolutely nothing happens. And it, it just, it just, it's just a slightly stronger pea shooter. This thing is already, what is that? Like a five shot kill to the head? Yeah, no, we're cooked. Maybe I should just stick to the knife, you think? And I'm getting my feet chopped off by a crawler. I've never actually died to a crawler in this game yet, but I bet it'll happen eventually. I did, I did die to one of the vermin in the, the last video. I died to one of the little crawly guys on the floor. You guys like third person? I'm a third person fan, I'm not gonna lie. Sometimes I do be playing in third person. It's a, it's a lot easier actually for me to use the Omni movement in third person. Something about it, like it's much easier to die than look backwards. It's, I don't know, in first person, something about it is just different. I totally would do this whole video in third person, but I think people would get mad at me because most people seem to not like third person. I'm just really weird. I'm like a, just a weird third person stan. I don't know. I didn't mention it earlier, but I mean, obviously, I'm not doing any gobble guns, so no gobble gum also. Hey, please buy the board, dude. Oh my god. Dude, this gun is like the definition of starting pistol. Oh my god, it sucks so much. Is that a green gun on the floor? Since when does that happen? Okay, how in the world am I supposed to defend this generator? I have a decoy, so I was thinking maybe I could use the decoy, but it's like 20 seconds. That decoy is not going to last long enough for me to do that. Oh, is it an insta-kill? Oh, that's, that's so much. Insta-kill. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. That's so good. Okay, so we're going to kill these guys real quick. Then we're going to turn it on and defend it with the insta-kill. Oh, God, he's breaking out. Nope. Get caught. Okay, 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 we did it. We got back a punch on. I do not have enough points to pack a punch though. I have no ammo and I don't know where an ammo box is, so I'm just wandering around like a lost puppy right now. Wait, Intel? Oh, thank you. Hey, ammo box. Thank you. Wait, I have mine. Hold up. Hold up. There we go. There's a nuke back there, but I don't know if I can afford to lose all these points, I'm gonna be honest. As annoying, I'm gonna die to this one zombie, dude. This is such a bad match. I almost want to restart. Wait, is that a radio with Rick Toffin? Excuse me? I don't know if Rick Toffin was in the radios. See, I really wonder how that works. Cause like in the new timeline, he's like American, right? He runs the CIA, but was like, it was maybe he was just born in Germany. Okay. Yeah. It's just a pistol still. They didn't change anything. Dang it. I don't know though. Like maybe, maybe it's different. Cause like in the new timeline, Samantha was born in Germany. Maybe Rick Toffin was also born in Germany, but he just like became a US citizen. Okay, this is a little bit more manageable with the new pistol. Should we grab? I mean, I guess we can't upgrade the rarity. I'm not going to do that because I think that's cheating. So I guess we should just grab an ammo mod. Let's grab, let's grab Deadwire. 
I don't know. I just thought like the whole point of a two box challenge is like there's a risk that you get crappy guns, but like with the way this works where you can make any gun not crappy just by changing the color, I thought, you know, maybe we shouldn't do that. I'm pretty sure I did one of these on Cold War and I actually did do the upgrades and I think it was just too easy. It wasn't actually a challenge. You know, it's supposed to be a challenge. It's not supposed to just be some like, I don't know, arbitrary rule. I can foresee though that my finger is going to hurt after clicking my mouse 850 times. So do tell me in the comments, have you guys beat any of the Easter eggs yet? I did both on launch day. I did Terminus and Liberty Falls by myself. I got to be honest, the ending cuts. So the ending cutscene for Liberty Falls was like really just weird. I didn't really understand why like they were doing what they were doing. I just didn't think it was that good. But the ending cutscene for Terminus, oh my God. I'm not going to spoil it in case you guys like haven't played it, but like i i i am a black ops 4 lover like through and through so you know i'm just i'm happy okay i'm happy Ugh, i'm gonna die i'm gonna die i'm gonna die no all right here's our first boss zombie this is what i'm anticipating to be a problem in the future so this guy probably isn't gonna be an issue by himself actually maybe i should get like a kill oh i didn't get it all well the reason they're going to be a problem is because if you haven't played this, once you get to like round 30, there's going to be like 15 manglers per round. And I don't know if my poor little pistol is going to be able to like handle all that. See, like my question right now really is like, when should I go and get my second box hit? Because the longer I wait, the better chance I have of getting like a higher rarity gun. But there's still always a chance that like I just crap out and get a green gun. And then it's just like I get like the, the rocket launcher. Go ahead and pack this twice though anyway since we're here uh, no get away no oh double points that's actually so clutch oh my gosh okay i'm thinking let's do let's do round 20 once i get to round 20 let's go ahead and get a second gun okay hopefully it's at least blue if i get lucky it could be purple right now though i think we should probably maybe try and get some perks let's definitely go ahead and start with quick revive I love that you can just dive over stuff like that. It's like so helpful. Oh god, oh shoot. Oh shoot. Okay. Clutch energy mine, dude. Energy mine so far has been my favorite field upgrade in this game. Normally I don't run energy mine. Normally I run like frost blast or healing aura. Let's also grab stand up while we're here. But in this game, I don't know. Energy mine is just energy mine is really hitting it for me. Um maybe we should grab armor. Yeah, let's do that. I also want to grab Deadshot. I don't think I can pay for it. Yeah, I need 4k. Because Deadshot increases your headshot damage, which I definitely am going to need with this crappy pistol. No, oh, no, I can't move. I can't move. Why can't I move 30 quick, please? Okay, that was that was a little close. Oh my god, we got the big guy. I didn't even think about him. Okay, all right, let's go. Bye, 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 freaking Deadshot. Let's go. I almost said buy double tap, dude. I would have cried. I missed double tap. Okay, how in the world am I going to kill this guy? This is gonna suck. The problem is, look at my look at my points. I can't I can't go buy ammo. <laughs> this guy, I'm pretty sure these guys regenerate health. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, I'm dropping a decoy. Drop decoy. Oh my god. <laughs> no, get away, get away, get away. I literally don't have the ammo for this or the points. I'm cooked. I'm cooked. I've only got my poor little knife and it's round 16. What am I supposed to do? Do I just have to sit here and like pity knife zombies? I can't even do that because I'm gonna die to the zombies. How much is ammo? Isn't it like 2,500? Dude, I only have 1,000. It's 2,500. Oh my god. Oh, this isn't happening. This is not happening. Oh, wait. No, I can go craft a grenade. Okay. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Give me. Oh, we need to make a tomahawk. I don't have the freaking tomahawk unlocked. Oh my god. Okay. Buy a frag grenade. Just, just one. Okay. We're just gonna do that. I got 50 points from that. Are you serious? This is all because I bought the armor. I should have bought the armor, dude. The fact that I don't have the tomahawk unlocked is actually like killing me so much. I just need to sit here and farm frag grenades. <laughs> I actually have no other option. Okay, that one got me a few points. Oh god, oh god, oh my god. This is actually like so not fun. I, I shouldn't have done this. This is my fault. Alright, 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 this is it, this is it, this is it. Yeah. Oh my god, that, okay, that kind of worked, that kind of worked. Just do it again. Yes, I have enough, okay. Give it to me. <laughs> oh thank god okay okay we're good we're good we're good that was horrible i don't ever want to do that again please never let me run out of ammo again yeah this guy regenerated like all of his health okay there we go he's down 
You give me a key though, that's kind of helpful, I guess. Okay, that was the world's longest round 16. Man, I'm still thinking about that boss fight. I don't know if you guys, if you guys have done the Terminus boss fight. Unironically, that might be like one of my favorite boss fights like ever in COD history. Like I know everybody loves Mephistopheles from like Infinite Warfare, but dude, come on, come on. That, that, <laughs> that, that boss fight is pretty cool. I don't know. I did it solo by myself on like round, I think it was round 37. It was, it was hectic. I was so so underprepared for it it made it so much fun but also like super tense i think i was sweating by the time i finished it it was so crazy see my dilemma right now is like do i pack or do i get perks packing makes my gun better but at the same time it also makes the ammo cost more and this game i don't know what i don't know what the thing is but like this game has a it's i don't know if it's a problem but like points are not common like when you're progressing you are almost always short on points which i actually kind of like because i thought before i tend to get like way too many points so i definitely think there's a there's a good oh i should actually use my key i think there's a good struggle here in this one where i have to actually like decide what i'm gonna use my points for you know i'm really having a tough time with the augments so far in black ops 6 i'm level 42 i'm level 42 yet somehow i have like four augments unlocked like they take a long time to get is there i hear a mangler oh there you are hello so i i want to know are you guys having that problem too do you guys also unlock augments like super slow because there's a ton of them that look really cool but i have no idea how to use or get them okay hold up can I take the baseball bat? It's a knife. I don't know. Okay, I want to, but I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it just, just, just for the sake of the challenge. But like, oh my god, there's another one of you? Are you serious? Dude, I can't afford to keep doing this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I cannot afford to keep doing this. Energy mine. Come on. Does that thing kill him? It does not kill him. Oh, double points. Give me that. One of these days, I'm going to die for a double points. You know, back when I was a kid, I used to think max ammo was the best drop. But now that I'm an adult, I realize that double points is the best drop. And it's, like, not even close. Did that guy just eat another zombie? I watched that. It took five seconds for my brain to process. I think that guy just ate a zombie. I mean, if it helps me out, I could go for it, dude. I don't know. Oh, purple shotgun. I want it so bad. Oh, it's round 20. I gotta go get a new gun. Okay. Please, 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 please don't be green. Please don't be green. Please don't be green. Please don't be green. Oh my god, please don't be green. Please don't be green. Please don't be green. Oh, it's blue. And it's an M4. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. This is clutch. This is so clutch. I'm happy with this. It could be purple. It could be better. But like, it it, it works. It's blue. It works. It's an M4. I'll take it. I'm so happy. Honestly, the fact that it's an automatic weapon is like good enough for me. The fact that I don't have to keep killing my mouse button anymore, like, perfect. That's awesome. That's great. Don't care if it sucks. My finger doesn't hurt anymore. Oh, that was not a good choice. That was not a good choice. I I just tried to die for that insta-kill. I should not have done that. Yeah? There we go. Yep. Okay, you know, this match is starting to look a little up for me. What should we put on this? Let's put... Let's do brain round. Why not? Definitely let me know any, uh, any other challenges you guys would like to see. I definitely want to try some creative ones. I think it'd be kind of cool to do one that was like uh, trials only. So like the only way that I can get equipment or anything is by doing the SAM trials. I think that could be a really, really interesting one. I definitely want to try the no purchase challenge. I will say though, this 200 round mag on the M4 is actually like crazy. Really? A Sigma? I mean, not that I care. I can't take it anyway, but like... Just, just the thought that they, they offered me the Sigma was just like insulting me. It was not, not very Sigma of you, locker room. I love that they revamped these parasite rounds. Like, there's so many more parasites now. Like, when you go back and play them on like Black Ops 3 on Shadows or on like Revelations, there's like five parasites. It's the easiest thing in the world. I like this because like there's actually like 40 of them now. It's like a somewhat of a challenge. You know, it's not just like a free max ammo round. I mean, it's still a max ammo round, but like, you know. There, you can die if you don't like you don't have a gun or something all right you know what i want to grab flopper because i flopper is a good perk to have especially the uh, the explosives in this game are like the blast radius is insane i mean it freaking it hurts so flopper definitely definitely really useful in this one except i need to put down the, i'm gonna die putting down this turret what am i doing what am i oh my god what, what did i just do all that for a sentry turret are you serious what is wrong with me dude i don't know there's something wrong with me there you go i i lost my i lost my perks was it worth it absolutely not oh my god oh my god oh my god, oh my god. wait no 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 hold on hold on hold on 16 health no hold on okay 
Okay, we got out of there. That was that was that was a little closer than I would have liked it to have been. Dude, I'm like the CEO of bad decisions when it comes to zombies. I just like spent my only revive for a sentry turret that probably got maybe two kills. Maybe. I don't mind the idea of kill streaks and zombies. I think they just need to be implemented better. I think that the kill streaks and zombies that don't put you in a helicopter are like good. Like, I don't mind the one where you can call in, like, the cluster strike. That That's fine. Fire and forget, right? Like, the helicopter, I feel like it'd be better if you didn't control the helicopter and it was just, like, an AI helicopter. Because I really feel like it takes you out. And then, like, all of a sudden, it's, like, your get-out-of-jail-free card. I don't really like that. But I don't mind the idea itself of... Oh, my God, why are there so many? I don't actually mind the idea itself of, like... Hey, you've got a, a helicopter. Now I've got the dilemma again. Do I buy my perks back or do I try and get pack three? I think I'm gonna buy Deadshot because it gives me extra damage. Extra damage is super useful, but I think everything else I can probably live without. So I'm just gonna not buy those. Smoke out. Oh my God. Yeah, so smokes seem to have like a varying degree of working in case you don't know like smoke grenades because they're new in black ops 6 well actually they were in mw3 but the whole point of the smoke is you throw the smoke then you stand in it and then the zombies won't attack you or like target you while you're in the smoke but you have to stand in the smoke for like five seconds before it actually starts to work so i don't know it's really situational and is not like the best tool to really use because, like, if you drop it in front of a horde because you need, like, a second, like, a vulture aid second or something, you know? You have to walk into the smoke, which all the zombies are inside as well because you just dropped it. And you have to wait, like, five seconds in it. I don't know. It just, it's like, it doesn't, it doesn't really work. Let me in. Thank you. I got a gold. Are you serious? I want to use that so bad, dude. I want to, I want that so bad. Oh my god, there's another amalgam. Stop it. Just stop it, dude. Just stop it, please. I have no more ammo in my M4, but like, I don't want to waste my points on ammo because I need pack-a-punch. But then I have to use this crappy pistol. Wait, he can teleport? What the hell? I did not know that. Oh my, actually, I actually did not know that. Oh, there's two. Oh, okay, that that's cool. That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. You know what? I'm actually going to pop my mutant injection because I'm not dealing with this. I'm not dealing with two of these things while I have a pistol that does two damage. The thing, cool thing about the mangler, you have like infinite health. Like you just, you just sit in a corner and just spam left click and everything dies. Okay. Are you serious? We're literally 50 points off of triple pack. Are you serious? All right. Come on. I need a single kill. There you are. You're mine. Give me your points. Thank you. That took like 10 shots. That was ridiculous. All right. Give me a triple pack. Let's go. All right. This is basically as powerful as I'm ever going to get. So better hope it works well. I don't even think it's worth triple packing that pistol. I'm going to be honest with you. I'd probably rather, I'd probably rather triple pack the knife. Maybe I should start trying to shoot off their arm cannon. See, that would be, that would be a good idea, but I'm kind of stupid. So see, I don't think, I don't know if he always drops the arm cannon or if it's just like a chance. Cause like if I shoot off his arm, okay, let me just like do this. There you go. I shot it off. Okay. This time he dropped it. The other guy didn't drop it. So I guess it's partially up to chance. All right, well, I guess now we should probably focus on perks, right? Because I'm not going to triple pack that stupid freaking pistol. I don't have much else to buy. Oh, I can buy tier three armor, actually. Maybe I should do that. All right, there we go. We got three armor now. Oh, oh, shoot. Not good. Not good. Not good. I make bad decisions. I forgot that they nerfed the crap out of C4. C4 is not valid anymore. All the other grenades are better than the C4. Oh, my God. How did, why did I just fly away? Okay. Did you guys see that? I just like, I jumped and like, I got flung by a zombie. Are you serious? I got a gold baseball bat. Dude, I want it so bad, dude. I want it so bad. Okay, maybe I shouldn't waste all my points on perks because I also need to buy ammo and I keep forgetting that, which is kind of weird. You think I wouldn't forget because I've had so many scenarios where I ran out of ammo and was freaking out, but uh, I guess I'm not good at remembering that. Ah, oh, damn it. We got this guy again. He just takes so much ammo to kill. I hate it. All right. He took up all my ammo, but now I don't know where an ammo box is because I'm stupid and I turned off the mini map. Oh, there's one right there. Give it to me. Come on. I got to get this guy before he heals. I don't know how he heals. Maybe when he eats the zombie, he heals. I'm not sure. Or maybe he just accidentally eats zombie sometimes. That, <laughs> that might not be correlated at all. Okay. I think he's dead now. Let's drop a monkey. The monkeys sound different in this game. They like change the voice or something. I noticed that. Look at that. That zombie had no health and was a crawler and it took like 20 shots. 
absolutely useless pistol not touching it i guess i'll have to touch it eventually if i want to get like plague what is it called i don't know the dark the final camo if i want the final camo oh shit oh oh my god no oh Oh, dude you get swarmed so fast in this game it's crazy all right we got to 31 on terminus pretty not bad to be honest not bad so now that it's been a couple days i actually i've learned a little bit more about this map than i did in the last video i'm gonna die on round one dude what's going on oh we got free points there we go see i told you i'm learning stuff all right so same rules apply no gobbles just gonna use the knife till we hit the box i think i can actually go hit the box right now yep oh wait it didn't spawn here normally it spawns here can i hit this with a knife no no i mean it's not shooting a zombie it's not cheating right it's just 100 points right i'm gonna die you know i need to stop saying i'm gonna die in every single situation that like i get hit in it's starting to become a, a little bit of a problem i think all right first box hit what are we gonna get i don't know i don't know weaver that box can definitely screw you over it happened last time okay that doesn't count yeah i guess i should probably say that but uh kill streaks don't count obviously i just won't use the kill streak okay you know maybe it could be worse than the pistol yeah no 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 weaver no you know the one thing i will at least say it's got a two times scope it doesn't have like an eight times scope can you imagine if i got like a 13 times scope on this thing because if we're gonna follow the rules from last time i i need to use this gun until like round 20. i'm thinking of maybe changing it up and just doing round 15 instead i feel like that makes a little bit more sense uh still you know i guess we better just we better just go try and get back a bunch as fast as possible definitely gonna need speed cola and uh dead shot wait can i do the dead shot easter egg i totally can i was about to say on this map dead shot is only in the wonder fizz which is a problem because i need dead shot but there's an easter egg that gives you free dead shot that you have to do with a sniper like i i have an idea okay i have an idea hold up wait a minute i just thought of something boom no more scope i can just play in third person all right i guess i guess my dream came true i am playing in third person actually i didn't think of it through it's a little hard to aim like really close up in third person i don't know maybe maybe that's not the best move so i've actually never used a sniper so far in this game so i'm really curious to figure out how they actually work all right let's see if we can't get this oh they're so far back there. there's one two i'm getting hit from behind are you serious I missed, damn it. Oh, they're gone now. Yeah, if you, like, basically, if you miss, like, a single shot, you don't get it. But, okay, let's check it out here. Oh, I don't know. Okay, I don't know. So, the problem I'm talking about comes from Cold War and Vanguard, and I think Modern Warfare 3 as well. I'm not 100% sure. But the way snipers worked is that you could only penetrate through, like, two zombies. So, the max number of kills you could ever get was two or three. And what that meant is that training with a sniper trying to get kills was, like, the most painstakingly boring thing ever that sucked so much snipers were like by far the worst camos to grind for in cold war and also vanguard because of that but i guess we're gonna probably have to pack this before i can really tell if it's better now go ahead and make it blue while we're here right here we go what is this thing gonna be called packed i have no idea the black ce black ice black ice wait it aims faster hold up hold up hold up they did something clutch here they buffed snipers this is amazing ammo grinding is gonna be so so much better what's that like in third person though okay yeah it's way way fast that's so nice so i mean already this thing is pretty pretty usable let's see what happens when i'm gonna really try and hit these cam one more oh did i do it i did it yeah oh my god that was so clutch you also pull the bolt back faster which is sweet i am so glad they made that change that is a very very necessary change i can't tell for sure yet but it does look like the penetration is better okay i definitely just hit a triple right there okay the penetration is definitely fixed trust me if you guys didn't try and do the camos for snipers back then like you you would not understand how happy i am that this thing doesn't suck ass if i was doing a two box challenge on cold war and i got a sniper i might actually just like restart the recording and pretend it never happened <laughs> oh we got our first mangler how are we gonna do against you i want to know oh, okay two shot pretty good let's get double packed round 11 double packs actually pretty good all right, I'm going to be honest. I have no idea what I was doing. It's actually the next day right now. I, I stopped my recording in the middle of the match to go do a live stream with some other zombies YouTubers, which was pretty fun. It was a pretty fun live stream. Oh my God, I have three health. I just got back on, dude. This is not fair. Okay, so I remember we got the sniper. It was, it was fairly decent. I also prestiged last night, which means that I got the skin 
the uh, the weaver skin that's pretty cool okay let's get purple on this guy there we go oh yeah look at that this thing is much much more manageable with speed cola i wonder if i could hit like a zombie's trick shot Ugh. It wasn't really a trick shot. The video is definitely not up anymore, but there was one old video I made where I totally like was hitting clips and zombies in the background. I mean, the video had nothing to do with sniping clips, but like I'm pretty sure it was just a video on like how to farm like the most amount of points fastest. This is this is like ten like a nine year old video. And I just remember me doing something like that. I was uh, I just remember I remember laughing when I was editing it on my PS4. Bless your heart, any of you who remember that the PS4 had like a built-in video editor called Share Factory, dude. That is how i started making actually no i started making youtube videos on a 3ds my second editor well no actually my second editor was windows movie maker <laughs> my third editor was share factory on the the ps4 you know i totally just realized that i said i wasn't going to upgrade the color of the guns and i've totally been upgrading the color of the guns i may be a little stupid but you know what it's okay nobody's going to watch the video anyway so it doesn't matter all right it's 15 let's go ahead and get our second gun at least something good oh okay i mean the the sniper is is cool but i'm gonna be honest now that i've got this thing i'm not sure that i'm really gonna be using the sniper all that much so let's just pretend i didn't upgrade the sniper and just just abandon it and just use this one instead yeah. <laughs> that was so cool dude i will never ever get over like the new ragdolls in this game for the explosives the way that like zombies just like fly out if I had to list like my top five like favorite features from this game, that's probably like number three or number two. All right, let's get off this horrible beans camera. There we go. That's better. I hate that first one. I don't know why they picked like that brown orange color. I'm sorry. I don't know. It's just ugly. That is actually like just so cool though. The save and quit thing. Like I literally was making a video and I saved and quit in the middle of the video and I can just come back to it the next day. Like that is so amazingly clutch. Let's try some trials. Death from above. Oh god, what does that mean? Kill zombies while at a higher elevation. Okay, can I just like do this? Oh crap, that is not a good idea. Hey, we got the challenge done though. You know, if you're still here, like on this video, how far are you in like your camera grind? Like, I'm gonna be honest, I only have like three guns gold, I think. I've been focusing a lot more on like actually playing than just like ammo grinding so so far i have the the m4 gold i have the ak gold and i think i have the the marine gold that's the pump action shotgun so i'm definitely lacking compared to like other people but honestly i don't mind i've been trying to like actually enjoy like the game for what it is and not just like enjoy watching an xp bar go up all right triple pack it's kind of weird but i think my biggest issue so far with this gun is the ammo i'm running out of ammo like really frequently and i'm barely replenishing like enough money to keep buying ammo for it yeah it's really starting to fall off now especially on those armored zombies all right let's do it let's go for that x fill i'm anticipating a slight problem with this x fill which is that uh, the x fill on this map typically gives you a margwa and uh, I don't know if you guys noticed, but like, it's kind of hard to kill a Margwa when you have like, not good guns on a high round. Oh, and we got 35 seconds left. Am I gonna die? Hold up, hold up. No, I can't afford to die right now. Oh, I die. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna make it. I'm not oh, I die. <laughs> Oh, dude, I hate that expo so much. That mark one makes everything so much worse. If you like this video, you'll probably like this one, too. Thank you all so much for watching. I love you all.